host, Tom Prasoli here, and we're going to, today we're going to be doing a tutorial. But this tutorial is going to be kind of different because we're going to be showing you Skyrim glitches. So, well, not glitches, kind of cheats, but I mean, secret chest, exactly. Um, so as you can see right now, we are on White Run. You can see it. White Run. Okay, why is far as we? Okay, so, wait. You might just have to talk to me because otherwise it, does, it doesn't work. Leave. Okay, so now, just to show you where it's White Run, just in case you do not know, White Run, you go on the main thing. And you go up here. And you see this barrel. I found this way by jumping around. There was a longer way, but it's just annoying. So you just want to jump on top of this barrel. And see that gap? You want to jump at it. You want to keep on jumping at it until you get it. And when you get it, you might be, you will be able to be, to be outside the city. I mean, the other one, it's much harder and it takes even more time. I like this one because it's easier and it takes less time. But it's still hard. Let's see if I can jump back to the other side. Yeah, because there's a part that if you can't get through this side, you have to jump to the other side. So, oh God. So, yeah, this barrel actually acts as like a little mount mountain. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay, so I made it outside, you can see. If I look at the main gate, look. It says open sky. So that means I'm glitching. So then I just want to go all the way there by the way this one chest i'm showing you right now is the one under the sky forge just in case you don't know it or you might be looking for another way to get in because there's three ways actually i'm showing you the easiest one if you don't get too far away from the thing because otherwise the glitch will end and you'll be outside and Sometimes when I really do not want to go at the main gate and wait, I just do that. But okay, so you can see Dragon's Reach over there. So that means that the Scully Forge is somewhere over here where I'm pointing. So yeah, when you get over here at this point, let's see if I can show you. Yeah, that little windmill thing. You want to go over by the windmill like I'm doing right now. And you're going to see this little hut which I believe is a battleborn thing. So then you want to go up this ladder thing, and then you go up again. You're going to see these whole chunks of rock and the skyforge up there. So you want to go to the other side of the chunks, and there's going to be like um, a missing piece. You can walk on it, it doesn't matter. Then you go on this rock, and you want to come up and go over to the edge, you eventually slide down. When you slide down, you want to get out, and there's a chest. Um, I'm gonna, ch I'm not, uh, as you can see, you have to kind of jump to get it, because it's hard to get it, unless, you know, you, you're skilled at getting secret chests, stuff, which, it's not my case. So as you can see I made it, there's a bunch of arrows, I take those, there's ebony ingots which is awesome, and there's leather, there's leather strips, there's a bunch of other good stuff, that stuff. So if you're a high level smithing like me, you'll find, eventually you'll find good stuff, if you're not, you know, you'll find stuff in your level, and you can see I'm on the Javars, or however you want to call it little boat club bar and then you just exit out of these stairs okay so as you can see i'm not glitching anymore and it suffers other secret chests this one it's all the way in dawnstar you might have heard of it i might be making a video on how to get the da request but I'm not going to do it in this video because my my camera has low 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 batteries. 
So you can see that from the reflections of my TV, that the one who's going, it's actually Danny. He's recording me. After these, and the, we will be making another video of Danny doing the Wii Sports glitches. Wii Sports, you know Wii. Because I do the PSP glitches, he doesn't. Okay, so I'm here. I'm not sure if you do these, but I'll do it just to make sure. The one of these guys will go like, and um, what you can ask for, what do you have for sale? You want to get to that girl thing. But she, she's called Akari, something like that. And you want to tell her. Take a look. Then go on the thing you like. I'll go on this lane is because I'm going for everything ingots. She has three of them. That's good enough for me. And some ice, and some ice leather. So then you sprint. Oh, sprint. Okay. Sprint. As you can see, I have the ebony mail and the a mask of Clavius smile. And if you so here and ooh, I see no mine. Well, it's because it's in the top layer. You want to go up in the first layer, and you want to look around until you find the mine, which looks like this. And here you see the smelter. So then you want to go by these little. Thanks, Rock, and eventually if you sneak, you'll say search chest. For me, I do not know why. My, this doesn't work for my friends, but if I stand up, I will still see the search chest, but they won't. So then I just look, you know, take the stuff I like, which will be ebony and gods, gold, granite soul gems, and ice wolf and lock picks and, and there's this bunch the thing I do not like about this is that there's always like a bunch of like potions and poisons that are not necessary in this game. They like well you could I'm not I'm not the kind that like let's put poison on the weapons but you guys might like it all and don't it's not like it's not like the it's not like the um, chest from White Run that you have that you won't find anything like enchanted until you put enchanted stuff into it. Like if you want to find an enchanted armor or enchanted robes, you have to like give him at least one, and then you do it. And here's the glitch. You can see it, the chest secret thing, and then maybe. Mm. Now I'm going to. S okay, let's see if this works. What I do usually is that. Um, actually, guys, I'm going to be making a one of the dead requests. So if you want to see the other way, the big way to get on the DA and not on the DA. When the white run chest. Tell me, subscribe, and tell me in the comments. And I'll be when I make the Deidre quest video, I'll be doing a video on that. And well, this is another stuff I want to do. And I picked earlier, I did it again, but I picked up a Deidre bow that if the target dies within five, six, six seconds, it feels a jump soldier. I picked that up, it was legendary somehow. And I know that's not possible, but it's just, yeah, it's weird. And so, like, so I'm going to show you guys, and I hope I can save. Yeah, I'm going to save. And so what I'm going to, you, you guys do see what I'm going to do for. I'm going to save, and then I'm going to kill the whole town of Mordo. I mean, of Dalsar. So as you can see. It looks really fast. Okay. Now I'm just going to kill the whole town. Tell me. 
How the heck am I missing? Oh god. Oh god, you know, I'm just going to do the traditional way. Get my two. Get my sanguine rose and my Dietrich sword. Okay, there you are. And swipe. But you're not going to help, little demon. Oh, there you are. Okay, good. Oh, dang it, he never dies. Crap, I hate these guys. Die. Another one, great. Okay, so that's the end of the video, guys, and I hope you liked, subscribe, bye.